everyone we are finally here the very last zone of vanilla Ooh, discovered blasted land oh i got excited i thought i was about to see something something epic okay is this is this like the flag of dalaran or They've got on the Kirin Tor symbol. So this is supposed to be like Dalaran-ish. Hmm. What's the Kirin Tor doing all the way out here? Minor distractions. Another guard has stood steadfast for years against the demon onslaught that plagues this land. Our vigilance unfaltering and our courage bottomless. We have held these lands since the portal opened, but now these horde insects have the insolence to stand in our way. We have protected them as well as we have protected ourselves. Let's see if you've got a hand for combat. Slay one of the horde's okra lawn scouts that nibble at our perimeter. Hmm, not bad. You're quicker than many of my men. Stick around, Loza. I may have use of you yet. Of course you will. Come on. The Horde are a nuisance that we will deal with, but they are proving more difficult than previously expected. Thin their numbers and delay their advance. Fellow know me button willow McKittrick. Say there, Loza is it? I've got a proposition for you which involves explosions. Interested? You see, I've been working on an explosive device. It's not very effective against other creatures, but devastating against artillery. If you're heading back into the field to visit those orcs, find some enemy supplies and give this thing a try. Who knows, maybe they like explosions too. Oh, 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 okay, there. Oh, awesome. Ah, the sound of things going boom makes my heart pitter-pat. You made this gnome stay, Loza. It's time for you to visit the Watcher. He's been in a bit of a mood lately, and I'm not sure why. Head up to the top of the Mage Tower and check in with him. I don't have any work for you here, but I'm certain that he will. There's a Mage Tower? Well, of course there's a Mage Tower. These are the Kirin Tor. What am I talking about? Cultists at our doorstep. You may have already run into some of the shadow-worn cultists that dwell in the caves just to the southwest of Nethergard. The low-ranking members carry spell foci that might hold an answer. Bring some back to me intact, if you can wrench them from the cultists' hands. Now we see if my suspicions are correct. The Watcher selects a spell focus and focuses intently on its shadows after a moment he turns back to you with a look of horror on his face kasim sharim <laughs> i need you to pass on a message for me kasim sharim is an old blood mage that knows a great deal about the demons of the blasted lands though you wouldn't know from looking at him he's quite old and very powerful if a little eccentric as of late he spends his days in the back of the Serpent's Coil, a cave not far from where you killed those cultists. Please deliver this message to him. He will know what it means. Mr. Shareem, wait! Ha! You Netherguard nincompoops are always two steps behind me, and I'm nowhere near as fast as I used to be. Yeah, he was walking super slow. I don't need Mahar's note to know what's going on. Why do you think I'm cooped up in the back of this cave? What I do need, however, is a strong gnome like you. Did you have fun fighting your way to the back of this cave? I admit, I haven't picked the most convenient of spots to perform my studies. Yeah, it was a pain to get back here, let me just say. However, I can allow you to attune yourself to my bloodstone teleporters. Simply place your hands on the stone in the back corner, and you'll be teleported outside of the cave. Oh, good. Then use the stone outside to teleport back. Ugh, oh, awesome. I was worried about that. I was gonna be like, seriously? Every time I have to go back to you, I'm gonna have to fight my way through all of these people? No. Hmm. <gasps> 
Excellent, you've managed to complete the simplest of tasks without dying. Like any good blood mage, I perform my magic with blood. All blood's different, and the Blasted Lands has several useful flavors, if you know where to look. For our purposes, basilisks and hyenas. Basilisks and hyenas. Hi- oh my gosh, I can't talk. <laughs> basilisks- what? I don't understand. Anyway, we're going to need plenty of it. A blood mage's gotta eat too. Contrary to popular belief, ancient and powerful blood mages do not drink blood. We eat normal food like everybody else, something which can be hard to come by in the recesses of a hostile cultist stronghold. How are you living here? Don't they know you're here? <laughs> the ash main boars in the central valley of the Blasted Lands are, if nothing else, convenient for eating, as their meat does not require any cooking. Would you hunt these boars and help me replenish my ever-dwindling food stores? Ooh, give me those clothing items. I'm famished. If you don't hurry, I might actually resort to drinking our reagents. Ew. You would like that, wouldn't you? These are perfect, Loza. I will eat well for the next several days. <gasps> Yay! I've reached level 59. I need that. Kasim eyes the blood hungrily. More than enough and still warm. Now let's get this ritual started, shall we? I suppose you want to know what we're doing. Here's the short version, a version at which I happen to be an expert. He's got jokes. The Shadow Sworn cultists wish to summon the demon Razalik back to the Blasted Lands. We cannot allow this to happen, so we're going to summon him ourselves and then kill him. Oh god. A task not as simple as it sounds. Oh, it doesn't sound simple at all. Let me know when you're ready to begin, and then stand back. I would like to start the blood ritual, Kasim. Uh oh very well, stand back, this may get messy. Oh, you mean right here? The blood ritual is complete, and I can now see where three amulets await you. The amulet of Alistar, the amulet of Savine, the amulet of Grohl. To summon our first demon, we need three amulets, and the first is the amulet of Alistar. Alistar himself is dead, but he locked his amulet up in a trove inside this very cave. The amulet is close to the entrance. I recommend using the teleporter. Okay. Thanks for the tip. The second amulet, Savine's amulet, is in the hands of a murloc. What? How it ended up in that murloc's possession, I cannot say, but I can state with certainty that you will find it there. The amulet of Grohl. Grohl, the ogre. What? His body, along with his amulet of power, is in a wrecked ship off the shatter shore to the east. His amulet is the last. Once combined, the three will give us access to Razalik, and therein lies our chance to stop his madness. So the first one is what, just like laying around here somewhere? Oh, I see something shining right there. Oh, she got up and slapped me. She didn't even fully stand yet. She already smacked me in the face. Okay. Ooh, I feel claustrophobic up in here. Mm, oh, this is it? Whoa. Ew. Whoa. <gasps> oh my god, what? <laughs> you will never take the amulet. Grohl lives forever. Grohl will kill you. Ah, no. Whoa, <laughs> that scared me.
Whoa. Someone's up here. Whoa. What? What's going on? I wasn't expecting this. Village gone. Family gone. Naga take everything. First things first. Murloc, I know that you hold the amulet of Savine. I need it. Oh, hello. Oh, they're called tadpoles? Baby Murlocs are called tadpoles? Fine, amulet take, but gnome help rock pool. Okay. Yes, of course. The Murloc struggles to speak your language. <laughs> rock pool attacked. Naga turn. Take villagers. Take village. Salt flop escape, but others do not. Go south. Talk to Chief Nep. Tool. <laughs> Maybe he survive. Okay, let's speak to that chief then. Whoa! What? Oh my gosh! What's happening? What are they doing? Why is this the saddest thing ever? <laughs> Oh, here's the chief. Oh, it doesn't look like he made it. Neptool. And he's carrying a trident. Oh, his voice. The murloc spirit looks upon you sadly. Saltflop did not shame himself by running away. Look behind me and see for yourself. The rock pool had no hope against the naga's attack. Though his lips do not move, you can feel the murloc chief speaking to you. The blood-washed naga and the rock-pool murloc have lived among one another for as long as we could remember. We have always had our differences, but never provoked one another. Why then would they turn on us? Neptua looks over his shoulder at his former villagers. You see what they do now? They enslave us, sacrifice us, force us to fight one another. I will stop them, gnome and you will be my weapon. <gasps> They're like whipping them. Oh, and some of them are carrying their babies. Oh my God, that is not okay. Justice for the Rockpool Murlocs. Just babies. Oh, look, they're carrying their belongings and their babies. They're really colorful and pretty, though. <laughs> it's never ending. Oh, that guy was hitting them. See how it feels to be whipped. I see you hiding. Don't think I don't see you there. So they lived in this turtle? Yeah, run him over. It's like the Murloc Trail of Tears. You have done well, brave monk. I am pleased, but I am not yet satisfied. Neptalon, the tide hunter, is our god. Oh. He was the god of the bloodwash too, but they have turned their back on him, it seems. They now choose to worship only Ashara, their Naga queen. Ooh, that is a familiar name. They need to be reminded that our father Neptalon is the only one who truly rules the seas. Neptul's revenge. Ah oh, yeah. Ah oh, yeah, this is what I want to hear. The remaining bloodwash have erected gladiatorial pools and ashir altars where they pit my people against one another and worship their false god. Slay them in the name of the tide hunter. A zealot? Yep, gotta kill this zealot. What? A 
abandoned blood wash crate. These baby rock pool Morlocks seem to have been abandoned here. Oh, you suspect that they are in trouble and that Neptune would want you to bring them back to the ocean where they stand a chance of escaping the Naga. Help the rock pool tadpoles or leave them to fend for themselves? Well, if help really means help and I don't harm them accidentally, then yeah, I would do that. <gasps> oh, quest discovered the future of the rock pool. The rock pool tadpoles left upon this crate appear tired, scared, and nearly dried out. Oh, they need to be taken to the water and quickly. Perhaps if you can drag this crate across the beach and into the Forbidden Sea, then they will have a chance of escaping and the Rockpool Murlocs may live on. Of course I want to save this race. Drag the abandoned bloodwash crate, okay? Oh my gosh, you guys. Uh. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, look. You go, Loza. Oh, definitely don't want to go that way. Mm, let's go this way, guys. There's some hyenas over there, but I think we can ignore him. Let's just stick to the road and hope for the best. Yeah, yeah, this looks good right here. Why are there, like, half-eaten corpses of whatever that is? I don't like that. Yay! Let's see it off. Bye, guys! Farewell! Good luck! The rock pool tadpoles float off into the distance, thankful and safe. You guys, of course I was gonna do that quest. Of course I was. Couldn't just leave them there? Anyway. Back to what we were doing. Oh shoot, I forgot I was wearing eye makeup and I just smudged my eye. It was so itchy, so I just like rubbed it. Oops. The fighting pits. No, guys, you don't have to do that. You make an old Murloc proud, gnome. Thank you, and may the waves ever lap at your feet. Razalik plans to return to the Blasted Lands and overwhelm Azeroth with his demons. Even now, he is preparing to summon his legions to eliminate us. With these three amulets, we have the method to summon him, but no way to destroy him. The gnome quickly draws a rune in the air, then hands it to you. Deliver this to Grimio at the Dark Portal. What? To the southeast, he will guide you quickly, time is short, and so am I. Deliver the discordant rune to Watcher Grimio at the dark portal in the Blasted Lands. What? I'm actually gonna see it. Quickly, Loza. We haven't much time before Razalik makes his return. What? Who's that? Who's that? Oh. <laughs> We're going to the dark portal. It's like right here. I did not know that we were so close to it. Okay. Oh, my gosh. Where is it? I keep thinking I see it, and I'm like, oh. oh, wait, no. There it is. Oh, my gosh. Epic epicness. What? Oh, you 
Guys, I am not ready. Discovered the dark portal. Whoa. Is this really it? What? Whoa. Oh, the Draenei. You guys. <laughs> I can't believe I'm finally here, standing in front of the dark portal. There are obviously some Alliance troops camped out now. Although these look like horde catapults, and definitely some horde supplies. Yeah, humans, Draenei, what? Okay, I suppose that there are some Horde representatives as well now. The only reason you see me standing aside Horde soldiers is because our duty outweighs our enmity, however slightly. We have been charged with protecting the Dark Portal from unauthorized travel. With my men focused on their duty, we need someone to keep the area demons in check. Around the portal, you will find three demon lieutenants. Slay them. I was just taking a rest. Eternal Watch is not as easy as it sounds, Gnome. No, no, no! Not Kasim again! This is madness! Please remain quiet. If my commander learns that I still work for the Short One, do you know how quickly I will be removed from the Watch? Grimio takes the rune from you, presses it to his chest, closes his eyes, and sighs. I see you speak the truth. Let us begin our business quickly so that it may end even quicker. Kasim wants you to gather granite chips from these chunks of rock around the dark portal. I don't know what he'd want the rocks for, but I have my suspicions, and they're not pleasant ones. Use this pick and look for small outcroppings of rock along the edge of the portal's blast radius. Yeah, it made itself a little crater here. The vile blood of demons. Shireen wants demon blood. Luckily for you, the area around the dark portal is crawling with demons. Infernals, fellhounds, fellguards, they've all got what you need in copious, pustulant amounts. <gasps> There's Shahandana. Wow, it looks like they were all worshipping her. Your work is appreciated, soldier. The commander leans in close and whispers, Gnome, if you're still interested, I have one more small task for you. I have orders from, higher up, that you would be suitable for. I've seen the horde periodically referring to a stack of papers on that barrel over there. I'd like you to take a look at those papers and find out what it is they're plotting. Get it, get it, get it. <gasps> Uh-oh. Oh, 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 someone saw me, that's why. Okay. I'm ready. No one's gonna see me this time. Get it. <gasps> Anyone coming? Anyone coming? Oh my gosh, hurry. 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 <gasps> yes! Got it. Hmm. You're fairly harmless. Either the Horde are foolish enough to not be planning something against us, or they're hiding their information better than I expected. Either way, well done, soldier. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> New ability, expert riding, flight master's license. Oh my gosh, this is so exciting. What an achievement for Loza, level 60. Ugh, oh, what is that smell? Is that you or the blood? There is no doubt about it. You have found demon blood. 
Kasim's request aside, I am sure that my watch commander is thankful for your efforts. They have been struggling to deal with these demon distractions for some time now. Grimio finishes packing the materials up in a neatly wrapped package. That's all that the gnome asked of us. When you see him, make sure you let him know that this task ends my debt. I will not suffer his requests any longer. This is sufficient. I will need to work on fashioning the stone knife of sealing. There is no need for questions now. All will be revealed in time. While I work, I have another task for you to complete. Don't look so upset. This task will be fun. It involves collecting body parts. Ooh, so fun. We need Lorimus Lepides, the demon hunter. Ooh. He knows Razalik's true name. And as you know, if you know the name of the demon, you have power over it. The problem is that Lorimus has been killed and his body torn apart. Oh no. If you bring me the pieces, we still have a recourse. Find Loramus's head, torso, and legs. This reminds me of that one American Horror Story season in Coven where they have to collect the body parts to create a boy. Are they just laying on the ground? Yep, they're in a chest. I see the chest. Got his legs. Oh, in this cave now. Got his torso. Let's get out of here. I know where the next one is. Here. Okay, got his head. Let's go, guys. Ooh, look. <laughs> Loramus's head. The eyes have been ripped out. Loramus's torso. Heavily tattooed. Loramus's legs. Pants included. I see. Yes, I can work with this. Kasim looks at the night elf's head. Loramus Helepides, demon hunter. I look forward to our reunion. Up on the bluffs to the west lies a powerful altar. A powerful, demonic altar. You can use it to bring Loramus back to us. The altar will likely resist your efforts, so you'll have to protect Loramus's body while the ritual completes. Bring the demon hunter back to me afterwards. What do you mean? I'm gonna go back to the burning steps, or what? There's another altar of storms? What did I see in the burning steps, then? Oh... What? So is this a second altar of storms? I don't get it. I don't know. Maybe there's two altars of storms. Laura Moose's body. Okay. Gotta protect it. Oh gosh, protect Laura Moose's body. Okay. Where? <gasps> that guy! He's threatening him. Don't die, Laura Moose. I got you. Got you. Parn Rakir. Ah, oh, hell nah. Oh my gosh. He's gonna die. It's because I can't even run fast. Come on, you ready, bruh? Oh no, Lormus's body is half health. This is hard. Grawl! You! What have you done? I see. This is the path I must take. Meet up with me back in the cave, heroes. Heroes? It's just me up in here. <laughs> My knife is ready. Loramus is present. And he knows what he must do. I must now take the three amulets and use their enchantment to grant you access to Razalik. I am prepared to perform the ritual on you and Loramus. Speak with me when you are both ready. I would like to start the amulet ritual, Kasim. With the power within the amulets of Razalik, I bind you to his lair! Oh god. Help. It would seem that we are prepared to face our demon, Loza. We have the amulet's blessing, we have the stone knife, and I alone know the demon's true name, Rock Leek. Together, this may be enough to defeat the Defiler. Rock Leek. 
your knowledge of his true name shall prove to be his undoing. Hero, listen well. First, we must travel to the Deathly Usher. The Usher will take us to the top of the rise. Once there, you will help me to defeat Rosalik, for I fear I am not strong enough to defeat him alone. Most importantly, I need you to hold the stone knife and do not use it until I tell you to. The knife will trap Rosalik's soul within its new, eternal prison. If we succeed, speak with Grimio the Draenei. I wish to face the Defiler. Oh, what? <gasps> what? Oh my god. Demon, I have returned from beyond the grave to destroy you. Death has not erased my memory. I still know your name. Rock Leek, come and know the demise. Fool of a demon hunter, how many pieces must I cut you? Oh, what? Oh, get out. Get out. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Ah, uh, get back over here! I'm trying! <laughs> Enough games! Oh my gosh, hello? What is this? Laura Moose, I see they use the Altar of Storms on you. You must feel it then already. The demonic energy entering your heart, your lungs, your soul. Allow me to speed up the process a bit. What? Now, heroes, finish me while Rock League's body possesses my body. Ah, uh, come on, use it! Use it! Lok Zen, Sa and Kill, Rafir, Morandas, Lok Zen! Am I doing anything? <gasps> Quickly, use your knife on me! It is done. Leave me here then, while I wrestle with Rock Leek in the next world. Your job here is done, heroes. Whoa! Whoa, so. Whoa! <laughs> Just whoa! Okay, how do I leave? Do I jump on that thing? Loramu resurrected, and then he trapped the demon inside his own body. By the light, I see. So this was Kasim's plan all along. Alright everyone, I really hope you enjoyed my Blasted Lands episode. I am so happy about reaching level 60. I really can't believe that I am standing in front of the dark portal right now. The last time I played, I went through the portal but quickly stopped playing after that so i'm excited to progress with loza get into the next expansion go through this portal learn more about lore oh my gosh it's been amazing so far i've had so much fun with vanilla i can't even fathom at how much fun i'm going to have with the burning crusade if you have been here from the start bravo <laughs> Thank you so much for supporting me this whole way. I mean, this is such a huge accomplishment. Anyways, I'm going to end it right here. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time.